it's nice inside my arm there. That looks horrifying. I'm not entirely yeah. sure what's happening. Oh. Oof. Hey, guys. What's going on? Oh, uh, God. I'm back. Feel drunk right now. All right. Uh, ooh, yeah, that goes up that way. So, what were we doing? Yeah, we're uh, down here. Well, do you want to go spend your souls first? Ooh, yeah. Yeah, might be a good idea. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> ooh, yeah. I'm going to go spend my souls and cream the crop. Oh. Uh. <laughs> oh yeah. Uh, he is my favorite wrestler only for that one interview. It's the cream of the crop. Oh yeah. <laughs> they know. They know I'm the cream of the crop, baby. Did he ever say baby? I don't know. Oh. I think uh, freaking uh, Hulk Hogan said brother. But he said brother. Yeah. We. And you good? Hey, look the. Fuck! Shit! Uh, get, uh, get it on your way in. Yeah. If you've got some bolts to spare, maybe just shoot it with the repeating pistol. Yeah, I'll probably do that. Back to fucking Hunter's Dream. Probably should have done that during the break. Yeah, might have been a good idea. I was gonna say something. I was also gonna finish my explanation on the Beast Hood stat. Oh, well, there you go. Yeah. So, basically, Beast Hood stat, uh, it gets higher with uh, less insight. Um, higher beasthood stat means a longer gauge, which means uh, more you can power it up. Powers up with attacks. As it fills, you get more attack, lose more defense, so you can keep it in sort of berserk mode. Um, but a, sort of the problem with it is one weapon comes with the mode pre-equipped, the beast claws. Mm. When you unleash their power, you're uh, you, you're holding I the claw. Put the, the freaking uh, the torch away, just lighting up everything. It's burn it all. Burn um, it. Burn it all. So all right. Yeah, you do that. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. I got a quick. S Ooh, wow. Next level, I get another. I get another. Get mm -hmm. another slot. Yeah. Well, that'll be the last level you need twin bloodstone shards for. Hmm. Should I equip the repeat? Should I? <laughs> what? I thought this was a joke. Are you yeah. serious? Yeah, you can upgrade it. It'll. Slightly upgrade the fire damage it does. I don't think it ever gets great, and it really scales off your uh, arcane. But <laughs> I kind of want to, honestly. Eh, go for it. Now Ooh. I need eight. Yes. Um, actually, I have the exact amount. Might as well. Yeah, you might as well. The the pistol is like upgrading the blunderbuss. I don't entirely see the point. Yeah, because there it's, is a point. It's... Between the two, it's like 25 compared to 112. Yeah. Pistols are really insane. what you want to upgrade. Yeah, Blunderbuss is really only there to freaking stun people. Yeah. But, uh... Oh, wow, I needed... How many? How much did I need to wield that? Freaking... Eight, eight blood tinge? Uh, eight blood tinge. Yeah. Interesting. You need six strength to wield this torch. <laughs> Yay. I love how my torch is higher upgraded than my fucking guns. <laughs> well, because you're crazy. Yes. But, uh, yeah, so Beast Hood, you uh, hack and slash to get the gauge up, and it'll fall while you're not attacking. And the Beast Claws come with it equipped. Um, Wait, I, I've never put anything on the... Right, yeah. No, okay. Yeah. I've never put anything on this, so... Or wait. Yeah, you, you got something on it right now. But I can't put anything else. Oh, right. Duh, yeah. I just move over to the side. Yeah. Um, physical attack up plus 1%. Let's just back up. That's no point. But yeah, so you fill up the gauge. Ooh, I like do that. that. Uh, the beast claws come with it equipped, and the problem is, like, you can use the beast blood pallet well, to get the beast not, hood uh, effect any time. I'm not stopping until I finish this. Okay, okay. To get the the uh, be the beast hood effect any time for a short period, and then you can just build it up with any weapon. Problem is, no weapon in the game is as fast as the Beast Claws. Yeah. So every single weapon in the game, even the relatively fast ones, will have a difficult time maintaining the Beast Hood. I want to keep the axe out. Yeah, meaning that the Beast Blood Pellets are relatively, like, not useless, but they're just inherently flawed in their existence. Okay. Those nine were... <laughs> wow. Um, 
Yeah, you had none in storage before you bought those. Oh wow, really? Yeah. Okay. So well. maybe after this, uh, maybe after this episode, do some uh, yeah, I'm grinding, do some grinding runs. Okay, so where do I want? Uh, old Yarnum again. Oh, right. You just drop down those ways. Right. Yeah. Then... All the shortcuts have opened. Yep. And that's as good as shortcuts are gonna get. Mm, okay, I'm fine with that. Yeah. Hope everybody liked uh, Matt's explanation and my uh, figuring out what to equip on my weapons and buying shit. I think this might this game might turn into my whole like Dark Souls two of just wh whenever I don't have enough souls to level up, I'm just gonna spend them all on healing. Yeah. yeah not Actually, exactly a bad idea. Because I need healing, and well, I mean Dark Souls two, I ended up spending all any souls that I had remaining on freaking life gems mm -hmm. because life gems break that game. <laughs> a little. No, they, they, they break it. You essentially don't need freaking Estus if you're good enough at the game. Mm -hmm. That's if you're good enough at the game. Yeah, but most people aren't. That's true. I don't know, you got some skilled-ass people in PvP. Holy shit. Well, sure you do, but those are, those are the people on PvP. Oh, you motherfucker. Yeah, I don't know why he wasn't moving there. Ooh, well, there you go. I got more shards. Never bad. So this is the right way, right? Yes. Okay. This is the only way. Oh, yeah, right. yeah, because this goes down to my, uh... And then down here? Yep. And then why do I not have this out? And then down here. Yay! Yep. Right back here. Right there's right. some enemies, right? What? Yeah, there's a couple of uh, beast guys in here. And I think that werewolf is just waiting out on the road now. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Hey, what's up? You better. Yeah. yeah, I think I'm just gonna keep using my axe for now. Okay. Yeah, I'm not sure what exactly the uh, the next boss will be to. Ow! Ow, you motherfucker! Yeah! I'm thinking we uh. probably should have crushed that, uh, that locket. Oh, right! I'll do that yeah, after. Yeah, do that after. Okay, so now where? This way? Yep. Okay. Oh, and I skipped those uh, those beast dudes, so I don't have to... Oh! In that fog oh. is a screamer. And he will aggro a werewolf. Yeah, good, good thing I got him now. Well, the werewolf's probably already in berserk mode now, but... Really? Oh, man! Yep. Yeah, there's really no way to avoid that. Hey, guess what? Fuck you. Yeah, not doing it. Yeah, well, he is one of the last enemies on the way to this boss. Like, you are seriously close there. Sweet. Well, I mean, makes sense after. Yay, more shards. Make sure makes sense after. Medicine man. Medicine man. No one lives down here. Need to anymore. ask a question. There's no one here. Yeah, well. This is old Yarnum. We're old money, Gatsby. <laughs> How old? So old. old. Old as balls. I love that comic so much. <laughs> uh, okay. Holy shit! Not bad. I mean, th there is a boss coming up, so it makes sense. But holy shit! Yeah. Now I don't oh, know if yeah. there's any more uh, werewolves. Is, can you just? Yes, it is. Yeah. All right. I like the setup. I mean, having the blunderbust is good for like countering enemies, but there's not many enemies in here that need to be countered. So. Yeah. And that goes back down to a previous. Yeah, that yeah. just goes down to that. Okay. Okay. Um, there might be a werewolf around. I don't know. Mm, I fell down. My mustache. Mm. My mustache. She calves. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! His mustache. His mustache. His mustache. They just break out into a Broadway musical about his mustache. Ooh, hello. That's that useful. Super handy. These statues better not become alive soon. No, oh, they don't. Soon. 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 Zoom, zoom. Whatever happened to that kid in those commercials? Oh, you got hit by a car? <laughs> <laughs> okay. What? The zoom, zoom kid got hit by a fucking car. Yeah. <laughs> well, he's standing right next to roads with friggin', like, super fast drivers around. Yeah, honestly, it was only, like, the first few, ep well, the first few commercials that actually starred him. After that, they just fucking used his sound clip for every one of their commercials. Yeah. Yo, what's up? He got too old. Probably. I mean, kids grow up fast. Yeah, there's lots of those crouchy guys. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, don't go into the chapel just yet, because... Yeah. 
there's something cool you can do. Currently, this does more than my sword. Well, they're super weak to fire. I know, but also currently, it is stronger than my sword. Well, it's higher. Oh, wait, no. No, it's not. No, it's not. Yeah, this like, is plus five. Yeah, so. Well, you're using the axe right now, which is plus three. Still pretty high. Yeah. Boom! Ow! Yeah, they do a lot of uh, poison damage. Jesus. There's at least one more around here. Ooh, crushables. Yeah, you can use those later. Yeah, just make sure there's no more dudes around. Will they come up behind me or something? They might, but... Uh, I want to say that there's no more, but... I also want to say fuck you to this game. Yeah. Well, I just go up the right... Oh, that guy dropped something. Oh. Oh, sweet. Well, what that yeah. does... Now, see that uh, glowy thing there? Yes. Yeah. Ring the bell. Huh. Oop. God damn it. Ring the bell next to it, I think. Oh. So that's the, uh, that's summoning NPCs now? Yes. That's still weird to me that ring the bell increases beasthood. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Assistance required. It's Alfred. Holy shit, he... Oh, wait, is he... He's using, He's uh, literally in a humanoid... No, he's just really blue. Yeah. What the fuck weapon is he using? He's using the Kirkhammer and the uh, Ludwig's rifle. Damn, that looks cool. I want that. Yeah, you... Uh, I forget how you get it. Let's find out. Let's go, man. Oh, he's just gonna walk slowly. Oh, no, no, he's good. All right. Oh, I, I know what's in here. Yeah. This is going to make the battle a lot easier. We have reeks of strong foe. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. Oh, uh, if you before you go in, there's uh -huh. one thing you can equip to make it a little bit easier. What? Pungent Blood Cocktail. Okay. It's the blood-starved beast. So... Do I have any on me? I'm sure you do. Yeah, right there. Below Molotov. Oh, yeah. Mature blood cocktail thrown to attract me. Oh, interesting. Yeah, so you can... Um, pebbles? <laughs> yeah, you can theoretically use that to sure, distract it for a couple seconds. Pretty sure pebbles aren't going to be very useful. Probably not. Okay. Pungent blood cocktail. Should I equip a gun? Um... Probably, yeah. Alright. So yeah, I'll uh, set that up. Yeah, hopefully it doesn't have a time limit, but I don't think it does. So I should... Axe is good, or what? Axe is fine. Um, th I don't think there's any specific, like, good setup I can think of right now. Alright. So yeah, um, just... This guy's not too hard at first. Ooh, hello. Yeah. And now this one. Up the oh. butt! Yeah. Holy fuck. This guy doesn't start hard. He gets hard later. I don't know what just happened there. He just fucking ran right through me. Yeah. He, uh, his movements are very erratic and hard to uh, keep track of. Yeah. Like that. Damn it, Alfred. Let yeah. the fucking beast go to the fucking blood pot. He's yeah. knocking it out of fucking the, the downstate. <laughs> yeah, Alfred is very aggressive. Weird, because so. he didn't he didn't seem like it was, like he was. Oh no. Uh Alfred has a violent streak. Huh. He uh he'll never be violent towards you unprovoked. Wow, but when you summon him damage. when you summon him against a boss, he is incredibly aggressive. And when you uh and there's a scene that later in the for game. like, a second. Yeah. Yeah, they, they get less effective. Ow! Yeah. Yeah, just keep antidotes handy in case it poisons you. Because all of its attacks can poison you. Okay. Yeah, the, uh, my gun did burn off. Oh, okay. Yeah, so it is time. Hi! Oh, it's going. Yeah. Damn it. 
But yeah, about Alfred, there's a scene later in the game where he needs a vile blood. That, well, if you rat out a vile blood, you can send them to them. Okay. And yeah, there's nothing but chunks left. Oh wow. He's just like crazy about how he purified them. Fuck! Okay. Yeah, this is stage two of the battle. Yeah, he is fast. He's gotten fast, he's gotten a little more aggressive. He might kill Alfred. Um, no biggie if he does. But he'll just make it. Yeah. yeah, I don't think he's spreading his air talks again, though. Damn it, that feels cool. Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm surprised he's not using his wheel yet. Oh, he has the wheel? Yeah, he, uh, he has the wheel. I think he uses it against you if you attack him uh, at his second second place he is. Yeah. And that's when you can get the wheel hunter badge from him. Okay. And he uses it against the wild that I just talked about. Right. Oh god. Yeah. Oh god. Launch that uh, antidote. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Yeah. Oh, sh okay. No, okay. I thought I was using an antidote there. I'm just gonna keep antidote. For yeah, not a bad idea. Not what I wanted. Ooh, I stunned him for a uh, fucking a brief second. Yeah. Yeah, you might be able to get a few uh, free hits on that. But he, I think he's going to poison this guy, which means just being near him will poison him. Let's see. That's also your best chance to just wail on him. On him. Yeah, he, he's actually... Look, Alfred's actually healing himself. Oh, yeah. It's like the uh, NPC summons in uh, Dark Souls 2. Yeah. Yeah, see? He, he's, yeah, uh, I see it. You might want to start doing the bone marrow ash thing. Yeah. And just trying to chip away his health as much as you can. I will use up all the bone marrow ash, but... Whatever. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Thank God for Elf. Having help in this battle is not bad. Get enough for two more shots. Or you just kill it. Nice! Oh. Uh, yeah! Thank you, Alfred. Holy shit, he was helpful. Yeah, I wish I knew about him when I did this. Yeah. <laughs> it's good that you're helping me. See, this is we were making this more interesting. Because yeah. if it was just... I mean, you did this on your first try, which I was surprised. I was shocked. <laughs> yeah, I was surprised that you did this on your first try. It was close, though. Mm -hmm. it, it yeah, you were close. watching me. I was watching this whole battle, so I knew, I sort of knew what to do, but again, personal experience is a different thing with this game. Yeah. It's like, you can tell somebody how to beat a boss, you can be like, oh no, you just dodge back and attack it, it's totally easy. You can tell somebody that and be a dick... Or you can, like, tell some people strategies, like, a few little things, like, okay, watch out for this attack, remember this attack does this, but let them do it themselves. Mm. There's no better way of learning how to play this game than personal experience. Yeah. You can't right. tell someone there what to do, is. and then... Yeah, they just give you antidotes in this yeah. battle. Alright, cool, I am almost out of bullets. Yeah. Alright, so, that'll... Um... Uh, wow, I got yeah. nothing for that. Like, no souls. Compared to Amelia, who you were supposed to do way later? Yeah, fuck. Yeah. So, do you want to go turn everything to night? Um... I might crush a bunch of shit and level up, actually. Yeah, you can do that, too. Um... Where's that chalice? Let's take a look at that. Uh, I don't know how to say that. I think it's pronounced, uh, tomorrow. Ritual chalice found a church... Church of the Good Chalice. Okay, well, now they're just being freaking... Uh, use the ritual at the tomb, altar of Hunter's Dream, to break the seal to old underground library. Let the chalice reveal the tomb of the gods, let blood be, uh, be the hunter's nourishment. And yet... And let ye partake in communion. Mm -hmm. <gasps> blood of Jesus for everyone! Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, other than that, uh, we're probably gonna end it here. So, um... Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I guess subscribe if you wanna. And, um... Yeah, and probably by now. Okay, um, I my face is covered in. Let me just. Yeah. Ooh, god. Yeah. And probably by now I'll have my uh, new game plus coverage of this game up yes. on my personal channel. So we'll include a link for that in the description. Yes. I am. Uh, I don't trust myself to be able to do live commentary while doing new game plus. 
because that shit is hard. Yes. Oh. So I'm doing post commentary on it. Hope that's okay with everyone. Um, do you think you might want to join in on that? Or um, no, I'm good. Okay, I'll I think, do that alone then. I think yeah, Bloodborne shit. I think we're good for that. I mean, I was gonna start doing Chalice Dungeon runs. Right, right. That's what I was gonna start recording. Yeah, but and you'll uh, be able to do that soon enough, I guess. Yes, I actually have. I have a Chalice, so mm -hmm. I'll probably be grinding for that, grinding Chalices to do stuff, and probably leveling up my character to make this game a little bit easier. Because it's, I mean, <laughs> it's pretty hard. <laughs> yeah, yeah. If you want to know uh, some good hints, uh, watch. Uh, at least a bit of uh, Vadi's uh, recent video, or at least recent for us, who knows when this is going to go up, Yeah. of uh, how to get all the weapons quickly. At least listen to the Beast Claws part of it, because it's very handy. Okay. Yeah. We've been rambling for too long.